Hello, beautiful friends, beautiful rising, good afternoon, and or lovely evening to you, wherever you are, depending on the location of your rotation. Thank you for stopping by my channel. This is our daily chakra energy reading, and today is Thursday, April 21st of 2022. So we are moving out of Aries season and moving into Taurus season. So I hope that all you Aries out there enjoyed your season and happy birthday to all the Tauruses coming up this coming Taurus season. So... Let's get into the reading. So all of my readings are intended to be timeless, meaning whenever you have clicked on the message is when you are meant to hear it. So if your guides have led you here, your ancestors, your higher self, spirit, the divine, whoever has led you here and you decided to watch this video, then there is a message here for you. So, let's shuffle the cards and see which energy would like to come through for us today. Thursday. Okay. Oh my gosh. So we have this card flip and we have the loving kindness meditation activity coming out. This is card number 61. This card came out for us last Thursday as well. So I'm feeling that because this card continues to come out so often, there is a lot of resentment and negativity that needs to be released. So within the collective or within ourselves individually, there is a need for resentment and negativity to be released. So let's read this card. It's the loving kindness meditation activity. This is practiced by Buddhists to get rid of resentment and negativity towards others. Follow the steps below. Step one, envisage someone you adore. Step two, imagine someone you respect. Step three, envisage someone you feel neutral towards. Step four, imagine someone you don't like. Step five, once you have them clearly in your mind, repeat this mantra. May they be healthy, may they be happy, and may they be free from suffering. Repeat the process for everyone on the list. So, with this card coming through again, I feel that it is just reminding us to wish people well. So, we don't have to hold grudges, we don't have to be angry at people or anything like that because those emotions only affect ourselves. If we're holding a grudge against someone, it is us that is holding the grudge. It's not the other person. The other person can is free to go about their daily lives not even knowing about the grudge that you are holding. So that affects you more than it affects the other person. If you have negativity towards somebody else, that affects you because you are the one with the negative emotions or the negativity within you. 
So we need to be mindful of how we are feeling and what energy we are sending out towards other people. So I feel that we are just being guided to wish people well. Everyone, we are all here on our own journeys, experiencing life differently, and we are all doing the best that we can with the information that we have. So depending on where you are on your own personal journey, you can expect someone else to also be there because they have their own journey to you know, they have their own journey to walk and it's not up to you what they learn on their journey. So the best thing that we can do is to wish people well and send them the energy and the mantra, may they be healthy, may they be happy, and may they be free from suffering because we all deserve to be healthy, we all deserve to be happy, and we all deserve to be free from suffering. So even if you are someone who is holding a grudge or has resentment, you deserve to be free from suffering as well. And the best way to free yourself from that suffering is to wish people well. And that what you are wishing for other people will come back to you. So that'll help for you to release any negativity or resentment you have towards anyone else. So that is our message for this beautiful Thursday. I hope that you enjoyed the message and it resonated with you. If you did enjoy it, then please feel free to like the video. Share the video if you feel like there is someone who needs to hear this message. Um, feel free to leave a comment down below and let me know how you enjoyed the video. And also, feel free to subscribe to the channel because it would be great to have more folks in the family. So, <laughs> I hope that you guys have a beautiful rest of your day and I will see you in the next one.